All right, hey, what's up? This is going to be a quick video just showing some of the hidden features in 4.2.1. Only two features. If you guys know of any other ones, then just let me know. I just flashed the stock ROM back onto it. It's a white, white Galaxy Nexus GSM. Let me turn this brightness down. Okay, that's a little bit better. The first one being, if I come over here, go to settings, scroll all the way down, there's no developer options right here. And in the last 4.0 ice cream sandwich and even in the jelly bean update 4.1, developer options was exposed. But it's not. And I believe in 4.1 they were exposed. I'm not too sure. I'd have to check on my, my Nexus S. To be sure. I mean, if it was exposed, then disregard what I just said. I mean, if it wasn't exposed. All right, if you want to expose that, I got text messages. Um, just pretty much go to About Phone. As you can see, I am. This is 4.2.1. And just tap Build Number seven times. And it'll let you know. In Developer. So if you go back, now you see Developer Options. And that obviously allows you to go into USB debugging, which you know, and then plenty more options. Plenty of more options. I'm not going to do that right now. Obviously, if you guys don't know, just tap this three times. And you get... I don't know if this always does this with, 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 uh, with phones, but... Unless you touch this, the little antennas or everything is going to pop up, see? So now if I touch it, it pops up. If you hold it, you get jelly beans flowing around the goddamn place. Anywho. Alright. Next hidden feature requires the daydream feature. Which if you go to display, you see you have daydream options. Oh, bean fin oh man, I forgot to. Okay, look, bean finger isn't there unless you if you unless you activated that hidden um, jelly bean flick thing. Unless you tap this version, if you've never done this and you go into your daydream option, that isn't there. I mean, you could check right now. I guarantee you it's not there. If you've never done the, um, the, the bean flick crap, whatever the hell it's called. It's only in daydream. It's only uh, available in daydream option on after you've tapped that build model or um, firmware model three times. Then it gives you the option of doing that. So when you charge or if you're docked. You know, this will happen after 15 seconds or whatever. And these will just float around. You can actually interact with these, too. Pretty cool. I figured it out um, recently, actually. I know. I'm slow. Or whatever. Those. That's it. That's the only two um, features so far that I know of. If anybody knows any other, please let me know. That would be quite useful. Let's check my messages real quick. And that's it. Mm -hmm. Everything runs smooth. No problems. The only issue I, uh, I have, and I guess it's an issue everybody's having, is sending picture messaging over Wi-Fi. tends to give you a little bit of a hiccup. I don't know if that's just the Nexus 4 users or is that everybody. I've noticed it on mine. On mine. Whatever. That's it. Take it easy, guys.